question, we have to find the equation of the tangent to y equals x squared minus 3x plus 2 at the point 3, 2. Now, in this question, the tangent is a straight line that touches the curve at this point here, 3, 2. And remember, a tangent always has the same gradient as the curve at that point. So the first thing we need to do is work out an expression for the gradient of the curve. And to do that, we have to differentiate, okay? So I'm going to start by writing out the equation again. So y equals x squared minus 3x plus 2. And I'm going to work out the derivative dy by dx of this equation. Okay, so remember, when we're differentiating an equation like this, you take the power here, 2, and you multiply it by this term. So we have 2x. And then remember, the power always decreases by 1. So 2 take away 1 is 1, so we have 2x to the power of 1, or just 2x, okay? Then if I differentiate this term here, it's like negative 3x to the power of 1. We just don't write this number 1 in here. So if I apply the same method, I take this power 1, I multiply it by this term here. So 1 multiplied by negative 3 is negative 3. And again, the power decreases by 1. So if this power decreases by 1, we're left with 0. And x to the power of 0 is equal to the number 1, okay? And negative 3 times 1 is just negative 3, okay? So when we differentiate this term, we're left with negative 3. And whenever you differentiate a constant like this, you're left with 0. So this derivative, this is an expression for the gradient of the curve at any point. Except we do have a point. We know this x value at the point of intersection is positive 3. So what we can do next is replace this x value with positive 3 so that we have 2 lots of 3 minus 3. And 2 multiplied by 3 is 6. And 6 take away 3 is 3. So this is the gradient of the curve at the point 3, 2. Okay, so the gradient is positive 3, which means the gradient of the tangent, the straight line intersecting the curve at that point, is also positive 3. Okay, so now I want you to think of the standard equation for a straight line, y equals mx plus c, where m is always the gradient of the straight line and c is what we call the y-intercept. So far, we know the gradient, m, so we have y equals 3x plus c in this equation. And now to work out the y-intercept c, we need, to, we need to insert a set of coordinates, x and y. And we're given the set of coordinates at the beginning of the question, 3, 2, okay? So I'm going to replace the y value with positive 2 and the x value with positive 3. And from here, we can solve the equation to find c, which will give us the y-intercept, okay? So 3 times 3 is 9, so we have 2 is equal to 9 plus c. Then if I subtract 9 on both sides, I have negative 7 is equal to c. So there is the y-intercept of the tangent. So now we can put it all together to write down the equation of the tangent. We have the gradient, which was n. We have the y-intercept c, which is minus 7, so we have y equals 3x minus 7.